Introducing first from Queen, Texas, Stellan Rogers. Alright, Rusty fans, coming up. No disqualification matchup. A real grudge match here. Stallion Rogers. As he walks out to the ring, it's a, it's a funny thing to me. This Stallion Rogers guy looks like he's bored out of his mind every time he steps into the ring. But I can tell you, once that bell rings, he's all business. And he has been going back and forth with Alan Martinez over the last several months here. I've been looking forward to this matchup since it was announced about four weeks ago, just the day after they last met. Martinez challenging him to a no disqualification match. We got it signed almost immediately. Martinez, of course, will be flanked by the manager of champions, Bill Alfonso. Be accompanied by the manager of champions, Bill Fonzi Alfonso. Flying by the ice of Chile. Weighing out 180 pounds. Representing the South American Alliance, Alan S. Tuess Martinez. Alan Martinez. S2S, an unbelievably fierce competitor. What he lacks in size, he makes up for makes up for with heart and intensity. And incredible skill. What an athlete is Alan Martinez is, and he's in great shape, by the way. Diane Rodney is gonna have a little bit of a height advantage and a little bit of a weight advantage but nothing Martinez can't make up. And of course, Alfonso, a wild card here in this one. No disqualification. Bill Alfonso, not shy about getting involved in matches. And I say I gotta give the uh, advantage to Martinez for that very reason. But Dying Rod is such a tough competitor. International experience, spends a lot of time in Japan, a lot of time in Europe. This man is constantly working. If he's not in CCW, you can bet he's overseas. He keeps his calendar very full. Referee for this contest, Amy Veronica. Amy calling for the bell. This one is underway here. And again, no disqualification. Fonzie looking under the ring for some plunder. I don't know if there's anything under there or not. Both men approaching each other with caution. And again, there you see the height advantage down here. Looking down on Martinez. Ooh, and a slap to the face. Martinez firing right back, and they're exchanging blows right out of the gate. Ooh! He caught him with a kick right to the chin somehow. Rodgers maintained his feet. Beautiful drop kick, caught him right on the mark. And Rodgers rolls to the outside. Time to regroup possibly, but Martinez not wasting any time. Tope Suicida connects as Rodgers slams back into the guardrails here at the Unbranded Brewing Company down here on the concrete floor. Martinez sending him back into the ring. Martinez now looking for the springboard. Beautifully done, cross body. Referee there, one, two. Only a two count, very early in the matchup. Rodgers got a lot left in the tank, I'm sure. Uh oh, look out. Fonzi throwing a chair into Martinez. Again, no disqualification. Martinez jamming that chair in between the top and middle turnbuckle. And Fonzi just set another chair in the ring. Martinez with Rodgers. Uh oh, Rodgers in first. Oh, no. Oh, no. He hit it and he hit it bad. 
that seat of the chair. Oh, and he DDT'd it right on top of the chair. Martinez in serious trouble now. I saw that chair was right in front of me, bounded back into his face. I might have caught him right in the teeth. And then taking that DDT on the chair. Martinez in serious trouble here. Rogers taking his time, soaking it in. He loves to dish out punishment. This guy is sadistic and he is mean and nasty. Not looking for a quick win here. Otherwise, he'd have gone for an immediate cover. He's looking to dish out punishment. Oh, that overhand chop that Rogers has so much success with. Connected. Had to take the wind out of the sails of Alan Martinez. And again, Rogers so methodical. Slowly approaching, taking his time. Fonzie grabbing the leg. Oh, man, oh, man, it's Shevitz again with that overhand chop. And Fonzie again, that time pulling him out of the way, giving his man some breathing room. Look at Fonzie, boy. I tell you what, Fonzie's got guts. This guy is in his 60s for crying out loud. But you wouldn't know if I'm looking at him. Rogers now. Oh, he drops him down right on that chair. Boy, it looks like Martinez has been lacerated just a little bit on the forehead there. Not badly, but he's bleeding a bit. I'm sure if Rogers sees that cut, he's going to go to work on it. Not that he saw it. There, it, I was exactly right. Rogers patting away with right hands on that exposed cut on his forehead, the forehead of Martinez. Ooh, that forearm right to the jaw puts Martinez to the mat. Oh, disrespect the cover. You're not going to pin Alan Martinez like that. Not a chance. Fonzi reaching in, trying to get that chair out of the ring. And again, Fonzi. But Fonzi is going to be the wild card in this match, I got to believe. As Rodgers just breaks the boot lace across the eyes of Martinez. And again, just so nasty. It's Diane Rodgers, one of the most despicable of the game. Oh, no! He put that chair in that leaping double stomp. Martinez in serious trouble here. Fonzi says we know what we signed up for. Alan Martinez, double tough. Rogers with that garden stomp, walking all around the body, hitting each pressure point, each joint. Oh, no, 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 oh! Put that chair on the side of the head of Martinez, dropped the knee across it. Pointing at Fonzi, Fonzi had moved that chair in so Martinez could grab it. And Martinez just doesn't have it together. He is really suffering right now at the receiving end of relentless abuse by Stallion Rodgers for the last five minutes or so. Ooh! Boot right to the ribcage. Rodgers now, again, with that boot to the face, and just watching it across the face of Martinez, the sole of his boot. And Ponzi again, trying to stop him. Oh, wait a minute! Again, no disqualification, but I tell you what, Martinez saw him hit Amy, and he fired up that headbutt right to the face. Took a lot out of both men. But Martinez in particular down with the mat. Rodgers staggered by it. But Rodgers still standing. Rodgers now with Martinez by the chin. Saying something to him. And a double stop right to the chest. Oh, uh, that bold motion. He's disgusting. Two. Kick out by Martinez, Fonzie in there, I'm sure. Fonzie, look out. Rogers trying to get a hold of Fonzie. Fonzie getting out of his grasp, thank goodness. Rogers had words with our fans at ringside here. He better be smart and get back in the ring. Martinez having some time here to recover. Martinez really in a bad way here. Rodgers paint brushing his face there. Rodgers with a waist lock has it. Martinez up in the air. Oh! Oh my goodness gracious! 
Martinez running right in the back of his neck in that German suplex. He could have easily damaged his neck, but Martinez somehow is fired up from it, and he'll wipe him out with a clothesline, and again, Martinez somehow, the adrenaline flowing, slingshot back, and another flying clothesline that time. Alan Martinez is on fire now and grabbing the chair. Stallion Rogers. Has him in the double underhook now. Martinez. Double underhook, almost like a power bomb. Right onto that chair, hook of the leg, two. Only a two count. Boy, where did Martinez get that from? I have no idea. That belly to back suplex, that German suplex seemingly woke him up. Adrenaline shooting right through the veins of Alan Martinez. Martinez now making his way to the top rope. Stallion Rogers taking his way back to his feet, but be careful. He's got a chair in his hand. Oh, and he just threw it right at Martinez. And it connected solidly right in the face. Martinez tumbling to the apron of the ring. Alan Martinez, he's right here in front of me, wrestling fans. I gotta see his eyes are completely blazed over. Fonzi covering him up, trying to get him, trying to get him back in this matchup. I think Alan Martinez could possibly be concussed here. Referee should be checking him to possibly be stopping this match. I don't know if it's wise for aiming to let this match continue. Rogers now on the outside. Uh, he's grabbing the microphone. Hey! This guy is absolutely disgusting. Well, oh, now he's got he's got a looks like he got a table there. Half of it under the ring. What does he have in mind here? Placing the table between the guardrails and the apron of the ring. Rogers now with Martinez. Uh oh. I think he has mind he has mind to superplex him onto that table. Rodgers has him hooked. Martinez, though, with hands, great hands into the ribcage. He drags him down onto that top turnbuckle. Inzaguri connects. Rodgers tumbling to the inside of the ring. Crisis averted for the moment. Martinez now with the waist lock. Oh, he has him up for the go to sleep. Oh, Rodgers. Oh, no! Rodgers wriggled down to the back and, and delivered a devastating and blatant low blow in this no disqualification matchup. Martinez prone now, his back is exposed, and Rogers just hammering away with that steel chair, and again. Oh, this time driving the top of the chair into the midsection. Going for the cover now, hook of the leg, one, two. Martinez somehow able to kick out. What guts, what a test of the fortitude by the Chilean natives. Rogers now setting that chair up in the center of the ring. I don't know how much more Allen can stand. He has taken so much punishment in this match. He's had some tremendous flurries where he's fired back. But Martinez now Almost out on his feet as you saw Rodgers drag him up and released him. Then he, he collapsed back. What? Oh, wait a minute. Rodgers inverting that chair. The legs exposed at a, at a nasty angle. No! I think he's going to super suplex him onto those. See, oh, no! Oh, my God. Oh, my God. He just suplexed him onto the leg of that chair. God help Alan Martinez. There could be kidney damage. There could be broken ribs, hook of the leg, and somehow, I can't believe he just kicked out. I was about to say this match is over, but Alan Martinez proved me wrong. And you hear the crowd here. That mantra of Alan Martinez. And again, he's got that chair, the leg just mangled now. The center of the back of Martinez is laying across that chair. And Rodgers now with that second chair. This chair is bent. 
very, very dangerous. A lot of jagged edges. Can easily cut the opponent. Fonzie now into the ring, grabbing that chair, and thank God he did. No disqualification. Fonzie not standing for it. But Fonzie better get out of there now. Fonzie in trouble. Rogers has a hold of Fonzie. Fonzie escapes, thank goodness. Oh, and a drop kick on the chair right into the face of Rogers by Alan Martinez. And Fonzie now. Holt always right across that table. Payback is a ball and it's split right in half under Rogers' weight. But look at Fonzie holding him up now. That table just split right in half. Martinez has him up. They all go to sleep, connects. Martinez now dragging him into position. Going to the outside. Martinez on the top rope. Rogers trying to get back to his feet. Oh, Meteore. Meteore's got him stacked up. Two and three, he got him. Alan Martinez victorious in an unbelievable matchup. What a tremendous win by Alan S2S Martinez. Oh my goodness, how he came back from that, I have no idea. What punishment he sustained. Stallion Rogers beat the living daylights out of Alan Martinez. But Alan Martinez showed what guts is all about and came away victorious. Congratulations and give the assist to Bill Fonzi Alfonso. Man, this guy's got guts too. Put his life on the line seemingly against Stallion Rogers, interjecting himself. What a matchup. What a night here at the Ungraded Brewing Company. Alan Martinez picks up the win. Fonzie raising his hand as Rogers tries to make his way back to his feet. Martinez with that chair in his hand. Normally I wouldn't approve of a beating after the bell, but if anyone deserves it, it's Stallion Rogers. And now somehow Martinez has it in his heart to extend his hand. Rogers making his way back to his feet. Will he take the hand? I have my doubts. Rogers far from a sportsman. But he's got to respect Alan Martinez as to what they did. And there it is. Shaking the hand of Alan Martinez and raising his hand. But I won't feel safe until Rogers has left the ring. I won't be shocked if he blindsides him. They embrace him. I knew it! I knew it! Damn it! That son of a gun! And Fonzie now, honey, snap mares Fonzie off him. Somebody get in there! No! Come on! Rogers with a knee into the throat of Bill Alfonso going to work on Martinez. Here comes Benitez. Rogers heading for higher ground. This son of a gun. That's got to be a fine. Amy Veronica needs to get this guy away from ringside. This son of a gun. Damn it. Well, Venetius now in the ring with Fonti and Martinez. Look out, look out. Oh, excuse me, had to get his elbow pad. This guy is some piece of work. How CCW keeps making matches with him, I have no idea. He should be, he should be fine and suspended, never to be seen again. Well, Alan Martinez with a huge victory solely by the attitude and the actions of one Stallion Rodgers. Venetia's coming to the aid of Martinez and Bill Alfonso. We gotta get the ring clear to get order restored here. Coming up next, a grudge tag team match. ERA and Ricky Martinez will go against Domino and Cha-Cha Charlie. We'll be right back. Calling all future stars of professional wrestling. 
The CCW training facility is open in South Florida. If it has always been your dream to enter the squared circle, then the CCW training facility is the first step in making that dream come true. All of our trainees will participate at our live events and be part of our weekly TV show. Classes are forming now for referees, managers, and for male and female wrestlers. Call 954-397-6421 or visit our website at ccwrestlingfl.com and find out how you can make an impact on the pro wrestling scene. Call or click today. Do you want to be a mark? Or do you want to leave a mark? I'm smarter than the average bear. Hey, CCW fans, Minutes to the Bell Time is your one-stop shop for pro wrestling news and information. Stay up to date with the Daily Wrestling News Show, the Body Slam Brigade newsletter, and check out our social media for daily updates. Find out more by following Minutes to the Bell Time on Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, and Twitter. Yes. Yeah. 